What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Always Occupied Home and Product Reviews. Right here, we have a HDMI cable, 30 foot. We are going to try to put it right on top of there, and then we are going to try to get it over here. So what I calculated was 20, I think it was 25 foot or 26 foot. So we should have a couple foot left over after this, but this is a very thick cable. All right, let me open it real quick. This is very thick wire. So this is up to 4K, so that's good just in case I get something that's 4K. All right, I'm gonna put it in. So I ran wires and I'm gonna show you how we ran wires as far as hooking the HDMI up to our receiver and how we actually hooked up a lot of our wires. Go get yourself a half inch PVC pipe. Very flexible, very flexible. Get yourself some painter's tape, blue tape, or whatever tape you have, as long as it's strong. And then put your wire, whatever wire you have, onto your uh, CPVC pipe. I don't know if I said PVC pipe, but your CPVC pipe, flexible, very flexible. You hook that on and then you route it down your joist right in between. And you see how I'm just running that wire? And I can run it, it hit the drywall, but I can run it all the way to that side of the drywall. Okay, everyone, so we didn't have enough time to do a recording on putting the wire from here all the way to the projector, just for the simple fact on, it was a lot of work and recording is not an option at that time. So we have here our uh, HDMI uh, cap or cover plate, got this from Amazon, put a link in the description along, as, uh, along with this one will be a link in the description. Just showing y'all this real quick. So, this is how you want to hook up your home theater. So you can either put your HDMI that way or you can put it that way, whatever way you want to put it. And then you put the cap on and then you drill in it. And that's it. So there we have our HDMI port there. I ran the wire from here, from there, all the way to over here. And then this support beam right here, this a uh, big space right here. So we ran it all the way straight down with the support beam. And then we came down to right there. So pretty much an easy, a little easy fix. I should have gave y'all this a little while ago, but this is two and three quart, quart corners. Oh my goodness speech impediment today all right so i have two and three quarters for the width and the length we have about four and a half inches so it's a little bit smaller than the outlets that i have so my outlet is for the width is three and a half inches Okay, and this one is two and three quarters. So when you cut your hole, make sure you watch how much of a hole you have when you cut when you use this HDMI. And like I said, the length of my regular one, I barely can see it, but it looked like five inches. This one is four and a half inches. So when we cut our hole, we actually cut to the box. That's what made it a little bit safe for us. That will be it. Like, comment, and please subscribe.